This is the dual 1911s and Black Ops Cold War. Yo guys, before we get into today's class setup, if you could hit that sub button if you're new, we are so close to 2,000 subscribers. And also hit that like button. Hitting the like button is the easiest way to support my channel and it pushes the video out into YouTube algorithm so other people can see it. Another way to help out with the YouTube algorithm is to comment something down below. It could be anything, it could literally be it could be anything, it could be about the channel, it could be about the video, or it could be a random emoji. Anything helps. So this is gonna be a short little intro. I'm just gonna go over the attachments with you guys. On the first attachment, we are gonna be running the agency suppressor to stay out the mini map and for the 8% added to the vertical recoil control. On the barrel, we're gonna be using the 6.53 inch task force barrel for the 12% added to the damage, 40% to the effector damage range and 120% to the bullet velocity. Go over to the details here. It brings the damage up to 56, the effector damage range up to 21.9 meters and the bullet velocity to 453 milliseconds. On the body, we're gonna be using the SWAT 5 milliwatt laser sight for the 35% added to the hip fire accuracy. On the magazine, we're gonna be going with the maximum amount of ammo and that is the 14 round speed mag. And of course, on the stock, we're gonna be using the dual wields. If you guys like this class setup or you have your own class setup, let me know down in the comments. Have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I probably recorded this a long time ago. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit that like button and I'll see you in the next one. All right, we're gonna be checking out the dual 1911s. <clears throat> oh my God. Okay, I thought that was a syntax. I was about to say, no way this game starts off with that. Um, hello? Where is everybody? There's somebody behind me. Is he chasing? He's chasing. Okay, yeah, there's no way I'm hitting that. I totally forgot to mute them. I'm glad they haven't said anything. <sighs> I need to remember to do that. Somebody tell me down in the comments to... <laughs> Just for jokes nobody else is gonna know unless you watch the entire video for this far into the video you know I'm not gonna jinx myself, but there's no way I didn't get a nuke with the Magnums. But I'm this close to getting one with the 1911. And I spoke too soon. It's fine. We just, with the secondaries, we need to focus on winning the game. It's very unlikely to get one with pistols. You know, actually, I don't. I don't really want one. I just want a high kill game. I feel like my controls are messed up. Something is not right. Something feels like really, really off. Are you gonna come down here or do I have to come up here?
Nope, not going. We're not doing that. Is there anybody up here? Nope, okay. Ah, I knew I had to get one of them. God. No oh, teammate move. Wait, there's a guy up here. What? What are you doing sitting in the corner? No. Yeah, there's no way I'm killing him. So we're just gonna sit right here and wait for him to come. Yep. Is he gonna spawn right here? Nope, okay. Why are you looking back here? Dude, this guy is the only one that's killing me off my nuke. And then he goes upstairs to camp. I didn't mean to slide right there. Excuse me. The only thing I hate about the 1911s is the recoil. Like, look how crazy that is. And there's no point. In can't put I'm pretty sure the only thing that you can put for unless I'm yeah you can only put the agency suppressor and that doesn't really do much he probably thinks I'm cheating how did I how did he know I was there The fact that we're barely even winning, and I'm frying with the pistols. Is 
somebody had to get it done to him. How is he not dead? Teammates, get on the hill. Come on, I need 90 kills or 100. Get on the freaking hard point. Okay, 90 and 8. GG's. Dead over.